let's imagine the Quran is like an ocean, right? It, it's, it's, it's like a, it's a bottomless ocean. It's like an infinite ocean right. in depth. Okay. And what Allah is saying in the Quran is that come into the ocean, you know, study the Quran, come into the ocean and discover the beauty of my creation. Right. Discover it. And the deeper you go, the more you will discover and the more valuable the pearls you will find, the pearls of wisdom, the pearls of knowledge. This is how I see the Quran now. I mean, uh, this is how the Quran, when you study, you start to see things differently. So if you think about it, so it's an ocean. Now, what most Muslims do is that they are sitting on a boat. Imagine sitting on a boat on an ocean. Mm -hmm. And they're looking at the ocean and they know it is from God and they know inside it is, is Allah's blessings. Right. Okay. But what they do is they they, um, they marvel at the wonder of the existence of the ocean. They yeah. marvel that there is a Quran that's been revealed. Right. Okay. They don't go in and swim. Yeah. They don't swim. Okay. Right. What Allah is saying is that I will teach you. If you swim, just come in. Mm -hmm. I will teach you how to find the pearls. I will right. show you the straight path. Okay. And so just come in and I will teach you. But what we have been told, no, no, no. Stay away from the ocean. Just marvel at the existence of it. Right. Okay. No right. need to. Other people will swim. That's fine. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.